Hey everyone, waving hand. Welcome back to Tech with Pi. In today's video, we're building a really cool radar system using an Arduino and an ultrasonic sensor. This is going to be a fun and simple project, so make sure to watch till the end. Please don't skip any part of the video. Even one small step missed can cause issues later. Also, the project folder is available in the description. Download it before you start so you can follow along easily. Once you open the folder, you'll see two files and three images. Let me explain the images first. One, the first image shows the ultrasonic sensor. It has four pins, VCC, trigger, echo, and ground. If you already know this, you can skip ahead, but for beginners, I'll explain everything in detail. Two, the second image is the SG90 servo motor. It's cheap and easily available online or offline. You'll connect VCC to five voltage, ground to ground and the signal wire to any digital pin based on your code. Now let's check out the circuit diagram. This project uses one ultrasonic sensor, one SG90 servo motor, one Arduino Uno. If you've worked on electronics before, this will look simple to you. Let me zoom in so it's clearer. Camera, wide heavy check mark here are the connections. Ultrasonic sensor, VCC 5 voltage, ground ground, trigger pin 10, echo pin 11, servo motor, Signal pin 12, VCC 5 voltage, ground ground. Take a screenshot if you like. Now let's move on. Open the first file from the folder. It's the Arduino code.ino file. Just open it in the Arduino IDE, select your board and COM port, and upload it. If you want a tutorial on how to use the Arduino IDE, let me know in the comments. I'll make one. This part is important. In the processing app, we need to set the correct COM port. When you upload your Arduino code, your COM port shows up, for example, mine is COM5. In the processing code, you need to change the COM port to match that. Once that's done, half of the project is ready. Small Blue Diamond How to Download Arduino IDE and Processing Now let me show you how to download both apps. 1. Go to Google and type Processing App Yexi. Download it from the first website. 2. Then search Arduino IDE and download from the official site. Install both on your computer. If you face any driver issues, just leave a comment, I'll help. Guys, I've put a lot of effort into this. If you're watching on YouTube, please subscribe. If you're on Facebook, make sure to follow the page. Folded Hands In this part, we'll upload the code to our Arduino. First, open the Arduino IDE. I've already included the required code in the project folder. Now, to connect processing with Arduino, we need to know which COM port Arduino is using. You can find it right here in the Arduino IDE. For me, it's COM5. Make sure to enter the same COM port in the processing sketch later. Now let's upload the code to the Arduino. Done. As you can see, the upload is successful. And with that, 90% of your project is ready. Hardware setup. Now let's look at the hardware setup. Here's the ultrasonic sensor. You already know it has four pins. This is the SG90 servo motor, small and perfect for this project. And here's the Arduino Uno. Most of you probably have this already. Let's connect everything. Ultrasonic trigger pin 10. Ultrasonic echo pin 11. Servo signal wire pin 12. VCC of both components 5 voltage. Ground ground. Fix the ultrasonic sensor facing up, just like I'm showing in the video. Now open the processing app. Again, make sure the COM port in the code matches your Arduino's port. First, run the code in processing without connecting the Arduino, just to see how the radar display looks. Then plug in your Arduino board and run the code again. You'll now see the radar system working live. Direct hit, and that's it. Your Arduino radar system is now complete. Rocket, the sensor is detecting objects, the servo is scanning, and everything is visualized in real time. If this video helped you, please support me. Hit the subscribe button on YouTube. Follow Tech with Pi on Facebook. Leave a comment if you have questions, or send me a DM anytime. I've spent a lot of time making this for you. Your support means a lot.
More awesome projects are coming soon. Thank you so much for watching.